Hi guys and welcome back. We're watching ReZero season 2 episode 19 and last week's episode things really 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 escalated. Um, we have Betelkius that is like currently well you know he decided to take uh, the authority which gave him strength but it's clearly affecting him. It's not. He's bleeding out of his eyes. Pandora healed him up. Actually Regulus got sent away because he was freaking annoying. Thanks, Pandora. That's the one thing you did that was really good, as well as healing his arm, Betelgeuse's Betel arm. She healed it, but she said she was not going to revert him um, accepting the authority and whatnot, so that's not going to change. Um, they are still in combat with her, though, um, it seems. We have Amelia that actually was meant to run off and leave and flee. Forgot his name. They said with an A. Oh, well, Blondie ended up, was escorting her, but then he got attacked by some forest creature and he's, like, turning into lava. I don't know, it's fire. Um, and then, unfortunately, Amelia's like, So if I give them this, they'll all leave? Like, mm, says, says, My heart goes out when she was crying and running like that. I felt like, oh my god, she really just thinks she could do this to have everyone live like normal honey that's not what they told you to do though <laughs> if they wanted to do that they would have done it because <laughs> they would have just given it to her. <laughs> but she's a kid she's a kid so she her brain was not able to puzzle everything together like that so poor girl you're about to ruin everybody's lives unintentionally but i still don't even know much about the seal or like why Pandora is actually at the seal or that's like a clone or something. I don't know, but anyways guys, so without further ado, I feel like a lot is gonna come out and go down in this episode. I feel like this is really the next episode following that decision to go to the seal, so I really see things going haywire and going crazy right now. So without further ado, let's prepare ourselves and let's get into episode 19, guys. The permafrost of Elior Forest. Ah! You found it for me. I did find the seal, but I didn't know where the key was. Wish she answered that question. Oh, new opening? Wait, what? No way. My brain. Have I? When, 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 why do I feel like I don't even remember this opening? Like, have I even watched it? <laughs> it definitely can't be a new opening. But like, what the heck? I don't really want to watch it, actually. Why does she seem nice? See, I'm really confused because... Of course Amelia's now is gonna be like, okay, like, we don't want- She said they don't want to harm anybody. I'm so confused. What do they want with the seal? Like, they're protecting it so bad. They're really- Is it because- They really don't want to give the seal because of the safety of the world, but, like, they just want to harm- like, what's their purpose with the seal? She's saying one thing, but the seal seems contradictory. Unnecessary sacrifices. The, the, she said, she didn't say I don't want to make any sacrifices. She said unnecessary sacrifices. I'd be like, no, but like... We will leave because whatever's in there is gonna do all the damage. But what's see what's the purpose? What's the emblem on the door? I would just shove my hand in. Like if it was me, I don't have a key, I'm gonna shove my hand. Consider yourself to be the key. <laughs> just walk into the door. <laughs> I'm the key. 
<laughs> I'm an idiot sandwich. <laughs> wow. Um, oh, did she manifest it? Okay, because her will is to open it with a key. Qualified. Uh, yeah, so she really is the key, and then she can only see it and manifest it, blah, blah. Witch's daughter. What's the purpose of this? Promise me, Amelia. Oh, she was about to break a promise. It's true. This is so cute because when you think back to Subaru and how he broke the promise of like staying with her that night and instead he made the choice to like do something that would encourage her later on. It's very similar. This is what uh, decisions are all about. Wow. Well, I mean, if her mom asked for that, it's clearly because they don't want that. But is she going to force her somehow? I shall respect that. Not with me. Oh, she pulled up. She pulled up. I, I wasn't sure. I was like, I was wondering. I'm like, it's taking a long time. So I was like, are they going to pull up? And they did. Oh, she is aggressive. I like that. She's like, I'm here to fight, so we're gonna fight. Like, like she is having zero leans. Like, yes, woman. Oh, shoot. Ah! <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> As you love your daughter. This is so disturbing because Pandora seems like she has no hostility. She really seems like she's just here like, ah. And I feel like she's speaking in a very like proper. <laughs> clearly though, she's the enemy, right? Like she clearly has bad intentions of sorts, no? Then you shouldn't have been there in the first place, sis. It's not her fault, though. She didn't think about all that. And do nothing further. Like, this girl seems so like she isn't mean. <laughs> but she's kind of harsh, you know? Oh, Archie. Yeah, exactly. And did you do that? No. You did, but you made a detour. So she kept her promise, that's true. Pandora loves these things, so she's just watching. <laughs> no? Problem. <laughs> oh, he finally caught up. His eyes are going red. Bloodshot. What? Is that juice? Wait, is that? Oh, she's gone. Oh my God. Amelia's gonna open that thing. She's gonna be traumatized. She's gonna open it. Wait a second! Wait, what? No, 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 wait, 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 no, 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 no. Hold on, what just happened here? Wait. Wait. Oh. 
Okay. He... He hit the right one? But no, I think he's tricking... He's tricking Juice. I think he hit the real one, and then she makes it look like he hit her. Right? Get out. She's... See? Bro! They messed up the scene! No! No, 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 no! Wait! She made him kill her? God. Okay, no, he goes. He, he, oh, he goes insane. Is this what? Oh my God. Oh, this is the juice I recognize. It's, it's coming out. Now I want to smack her. That's true. It's actually true because what he saw is what he saw. Bro! Okay, Amelia should. I would have expected her to be bawling her eyes out way more. Is this like a brainwashing? Is this why he just kills. Dang, this is how. This is how it plays. Damn, bro. This is how everything played out, fam. But there's still something about her staying with her and how she called her Leah. And Puck calls her Leah. I don't know. Something's... I don't know if there's a link, but I'm just saying. Amelia is handling this, handling this a lot better than I expected. Wow, she's being big girl here. She's gone. Oh, not yet. Dang, that's sad. Ugh, I'd be crying if I wasn't holding back. <laughs> no more crying this week, child. Obviously. That's not how it works, sis. That's not how it works. That's not how a promise to someone works. But I could see how witnessing this is enough to make her think, let me just open this darn thing. Oh, that's true. That is what she wears, huh? Shinja. <laughs> Not when it comes to you. Why won't she die? What the heck is going on? What is wrong with her? Wait, why is everyone freezing? Is she... Even Juice was like starting to... Oh, so yeah, she's... Her state is doing this right now. Oh, she's even freezing herself. Into a deep sleep soon. Oh, and then she freezes everyone. Oh my god! It wasn't even- So to this day, she actually never opened the seal! How is she so invincible? She really is not freezing at all. <laughs> oh! Okay, but now she has a memory, so she's not playing with you, Pandora! Uh-uh! <laughs> Shinjo, that's what you're gonna be saying the next time she sees you. Ah, oh, but then there's juice also. <gasps> oh no, this hurts me. This hurts me. Oh, he lost it, lost. This is seeing his story is driving me nuts. To think that this is how everything played out. 
This is his story is so depressing to me now. And now when I think back at his death, I'm just like, damn. Damn. Okay, I have a really, I have a potentially stupid question to ask. Potentially stupid question to ask. I'm guessing Amelia survived. One, because of like Puck or something. Because I remember they showed Puck pull up. She survived because of Puck or because she does not succumb to her technique and she did not die. I guess everyone else is dead, right? Like, they can't be, like, revived from the ice like her. Do you, do you get what I'm saying here? It's like, I'm guessing she's special and she didn't freeze quite like everyone else did. Or it's because Puck saved her. But, like, does that mean the others are actually dead, though? Or can they actually be saved to this day? Like, it's crazy. But I don't think so. I'm pretty sure they're all dead. But that was just a thought. You know what? I don't is that true? At the, you know, it's funny. I mean, yes, she went off and she froze everybody. That is very true. But she did prevent the seal from being opened. And I don't know what the consequences of the seal being opened would exactly be. Apparently, everyone, like, they would destroy the world or something. I don't know. Apparently, it's, like, so, so, so bad. So, in that situation, let's say she ran away. She ran away, you know, Fortuna, Juice... Would have stayed behind regardless to fight Pandora. So, Juice still could have been manipulated visually and killed Fortuna, and just everyone could have died. Like, I feel like it would have resulted in the same whether Amelia leaves or not. But the reason why I feel like Amelia actually not leaving may have been a better outcome was because they had to leave and save it to fight another day. Whereas, let's say Amelia left and did not witness the death right in front of her eyes that would trigger her to react that way she would probably be forced to somehow open the seal which could have resulted in something even worse but she had to witness that situation lose it freeze everything and it's like dang i am gonna have to come back and handle this and the seal's not open it's interesting it makes you wonder if like that was probably the best outcome believe it or not but unfortunately Everyone in the forest died, but did that, like, did that save the a grander scheme of things? I don't know. I'm not sure, but, so yeah, it's just interesting. It was no more than a dream. True. In the end, everyone's just, everyone is gone, but what's left for you? Okay, she's fine. For sure! Oh my gosh! Exactly, that's literally it. I regret that I was like a little weak child. Like, damn. Yeah, that's true. I wouldn't regret that as much either. I would regret like giving in to what she was fighting for. No. See, that's exactly what I was saying. They're still sleeping. See? Exactly. They're not dead. Okay. Oh, okay, so that's what I thought. I'm like, are they dead though? Seriously, we don't got to worry about all that. Okay, there you go. Oh, I feel so sad. Why are you trying to fight? <laughs> nice girl. She definitely passed this. But where does Puck come in? I know I saw him, like... Okay, two trials remain. Yeah, three! (sighs) 
In a sense, she's abandoned all that. Sis, you can make really creepy faces. I can't read that! <laughs> of course, that's still... Damn. That's so sad. <laughs> Where is she going? Where is uh, she? What the hell? Where are you guys going? <laughs> Hold on a minute. It just said... Oi, oi. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about when Bakugo says that. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this is like during the time while she's still in there, so it's not gonna clash. Right now, that was actually one normal sentence. <laughs> Wait, what did he say? I can have a shock a little. <laughs> oh, I love you so much. Let me tell you something, I'm so happy about this because you know how many times they always have like... Okay. I get it, there's harems, I understand, I understand, okay? But I'm just so happy it's like just a male best friend, like, yes! Oh my gosh! Can we normalize male broships that are really supportive and like... And of course I've seen it, but there's male broships where we're like shipping and stuff like that. Where it's like so freaking intense where you're like, wow, you guys should just get married. And then there's like a broship where you feel like, oh my god, what a friend. Where you're like, that's really a friendship. And that's how I feel about this one. Of course you can go as far as shipping if you want. But that's not the first impression I get from these two. I get now he got himself a good friend, and I'm so happy about that. And I can't believe he just said it. It's like, normally it's a heroin, but no, it's not. And I'm like, yeah, so happy. I'm not. <laughs> I am not Jodan, okay? Oh, we don't know that because they didn't finish the story with us. Dang, alright guys, well, hmm, okay, this episode is ending well, everything's ending well, but we cannot say we're out of the water, okay, we know this show, things can go downhill, or just get, not necessarily even downhill, but things could just get really intense and a lot real quick, um, so I feel like now that we've reached where we've reached and things are like starting to roll now in another direction, we can expect some things, but I feel like while we're in the sanctuary, things are gonna be fine, okay? While we're here, things will be fine. So it's the other stuff we gotta worry about once we get out, once we do other things, but while it, the trials are happening, everything, I think everything is gonna be fine. Um, so Amelia has two more trials to do. Her story is very, very sad, and it's really unfortunate. Like, I completely understand how she's like, I'm 
what I regret is that this happened when I couldn't think properly, when I was too weak. Had I, with all the, do you see how strong she, she was even at her age? If she was skilled and, and mature and strong enough to use her abilities, imagine she could just protect everybody. You know, Juice wouldn't have to get involved. Pandora is gone. You know what I mean? Like, if she was able to protect them, imagine the difference that could make in their lives as a whole. So I completely understand having a regret like that, but that's an, an, an like an inevitable regret. You can't change that. You were, you were young. You were a child, and that's it. Um, so it's just more like just thinking about how different things could have been if simply this fact was changed. But yeah, I also agree with her saying, you know, I don't regret not breaking my promise. You know, she died and everything, and you feel like that's the one thing that you did right. So I completely understand that. You know, Juice, that talk you still makes me real sad, bro. He was such a good guy. He was cute. <laughs> he was actually... You can't tell me that going insane is going to give you a whole new jaw. I mean, a whole new bone structure. That's what he got. Like, I, I, But anyway, so yeah. Um, he completely changed in appearance-wise, but not just appearance. He lost it. He completely lost it. And... All this was a manipulation. He feels like all of his actions were done on love. So I feel like this is what he feels. Uh, love is now aggressive and love is whatever demented form of love he currently was worshipping later, later on. So it's just very unfortunate how he died too. It's crazy because to us, we wanted him dead. And him dying didn't mean much like that but then when you go back to when you see this story and then now i'm thinking about him dying i'm just like oh this is just so depressing it's insane a whole new perspective you can get after knowing a backstory to something which is why they always say don't judge a book by its cover don't do all this but you know it's hard not to especially when you're watching a show because you don't know what they're gonna give us i had no idea they were gonna give us a backstory like this for this guy I thought it was a done deal. <laughs> this guy was just insane. To think that his story went this far. From the moment Betty said his name, I was like, the hell? Like, why is... Wow. That's so depressing. Unbelievable. And it's really crazy how they did that. They really brought him in, in his worst form, where we know nothing about him, just to tell us all this about him after. We're just like, oh, man. So it's very unfortunate. Um... And he actually ended up killing his girl that he liked, I'm pretty sure. Oh, wow, anyways, it's, it just sucks that all that is over before, like, he didn't even get a ch Like, his character in the future, we didn't even get a sense of, like, he was able to return to himself or... They just ended it, like, he died, like, they just ended it. And to think, like, now, what I would, would have, like, if he was still alive, I would hope that in the future, Amelia and him could have an encounter that even if he still dies it's like he's able to return to who he really is and he can say something to amelia you know what i mean that's what i feel like a normal story should happen but he's already dead he was crushed he was like what the hell he's already gone and there's no way that will ever happen so that that when i think about that i'm like the way they made that storyline for him is very unique and just raw and it's just so oh my god unfortunate um, but yeah, Amelia, she's stronger now, she's gonna have her other two trials to do, and then, uh, you know, Sivirder is, uh, out here, he's taking proper, well, we won't know if they're proper until later, but he is taking proper steps, he's going full throttle, he already has, um, Garfield on his side, he has Otto, things are looking up, things are looking up right now, but we can't imagine to keep looking up for too, 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 too long. So I'm always going to be prepared. Actually, I'm rarely prepared, but I'm always going to try to be prepared for whatever happens in this show. But that is it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Leave how you feel, thoughts down below, and I'll see you all again in my next video. So thank you so much, and bye!